Yeah. Hello, Woo. everybody. Woo. Welcome. Yeah. Uh, we only have 30 minutes, and I heard that we have a couple of slides to go through. Yeah, we may have some information in these slides as well. You may be interested. So this is our wrap-up ceremony for today, but we are not closing the conference because... Tonight, there is trivia night. <laughs> and just to make it clear, if you are attending first time, there is extra points. If you are like, you know, there are all kinds of goodies, so make sure you pick your team and not just the usuals, okay? Yeah, there are some really good prizes that you can win, and it's a lot of fun. And also, tomorrow is Contribution Day. So, yes. And it's the first time that we sold out the contribution room and need to increase the capacity in the contribution room, so that's an achievement. Thank you. So we'll have, we'll have stuff for first-timers who've never contributed to Drupal. You will learn about the tools and the process. If you contributed before but need issues or help with making progress with issues, then we have mentored contribution. If you want to be involved with one of the initiatives, then the general contribution is there. And you can also set up your own initiative table at the general contribution. So and you're you get all welcome. Food. You get food as well, which okay, is useful. Awesome. Yes. But let's look at the group photo, right? And coffee. So coffee. <laughs> Wow. There's a lot of us here. So how many, how many were we here today? How many, how many checked in, Gabor? So we were 1,168 people. Wow. At DrupalCon Prague. And we have a little video for you to show of how this went. Thank you, Dan, and everybody else who has been taking photos. So but there's oh. one more special thing that happened today. Yeah, we had the Women in Drupal Award. And <laughs> we had three categories. Uh, Christina, Surabi, and Stella all got uh, awarded this Women in Drupal Award that was sponsored by FFW for the first time. And we've heard that this is going to be a tradition at DrupalCon Europe. So let's make sure that we nominate everyone we know for next year. Yeah. So we would like to thank all of the supporters of the Grants and Scholarships program for this conference that allowed several attendees to be here that couldn't make it otherwise. We'd also like to thank our volunteers. <laughs> which included the European Advisory Committee. So we have so many slides. We have so many people to thank you. So these are the ones who put together the program here, who helped Kooni organizing the track tier leads. Then you have yep. the track team people, those who are counting who, how many are in each room. Selected for our sessions for you. There's the people that are mentoring that did the first time workshops already and will mentor tomorrow as well. 
We would like to also thank all of our speakers who provided the amazing content for the conference. We will not have a photo of each speaker. Uh, we would like to thank all of our sponsors, Diamond sponsor Acquia, Drop Solid, Pantheon, <laughs> Platform SH, or of our platinum sponsors. Ooh. <laughs> and then the gold sponsors. All of our gold sponsors, as well as our silver sponsors, all the module sponsors that supported the contribution days and other activities at the conference, our media sponsors, and our other sponsors. We'd also like to thank Kuoni, who was amazing putting together this event. They are up there. They are there. Thank you all. We've been working with them for more than a year now in this conference, and we'll likely continue working on next year. But we're not allowed to tell you the next year yet. But he knows. Oh, uh -huh. he knows. That's mm -hmm. interesting. Yep. So we would also like to thank the Drupal Association for all of their support and all the work that they do for the community. And if you are a Drupal Association member, the board election voting started yesterday. Yes. You, so should, have, you should have received an email, so check it out and, and give in your vote, please. Yeah. And now let's talk about next year. Ooh. Exciting. Yeah. OK, so what is going to happen next year? So next year, three of you will be at DrupalCon already, because we had this game in the mobile app that you were collecting points throughout the conference. And so the highest point winner gets a free <laughs> registration for next year, and that is? Dan Golovatic. Yes. From Intrivo. Is he here? Are you here? Congratulations. Dan, are you here? Are you here anywhere? No? OK, but good. We are going to send you an email. Yeah, Kuoni will reach out with the details for the registration. And the other two tickets that people could win in this point contest are drawn among all the people who are collecting points. So we are actually going to pick a lot of people to na today to get all kinds of uh, things. So if yeah. your name gets announced, then please don't come up here, because we don't have time for the. Yeah, unfortunately But we not. are going to reach out to you afterwards. And uh, so yeah, so yeah, let's do so the let's raffle. Let's see who wins the two tickets for next year. And the winner is. Salman Haider. Congrats. Working. <laughs> oh, we have another one. And our final winner is. Wait for it. Jessica ah, Denkela from Ramsoft Lab. So again, you will be contacted, but now we have the passport contest. How yeah. did that work, actually? And you will draw Many the people. winners. So we've had all the people who visited all of the, boo all of the booths, all of our exhibitors are in this ball here. And now Betty will pick the winners. Okay. First for three Acquia certification vouchers. Three. Three of them, okay, yes. Okay, one, two, three. We start with... The Drupal Viking, Hilmar Hatperson. Oh, congrats. Okay. Next one. Then we have Sinduri Kuntopalli. Okay, great. Congrats. And we have Peter uh, Lotsovitsky. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> congrats. Okay, these are three. So um, okay, so how are we going to do this? Aquia certification vouchers. The okay. next one. Next one winner one. gets three months supply of sustainably grown coffee from Platform SH. That's Mario Lopez. Congrats. So you will get your prizes after this session. So next up is 1X Internet, two tote bags and with some goodies. OK, that's Renato Gomez. <laughs> and Milan Gurianov. Nice. Milan Gurianov. Congrats. 
ました。Oh, so And okay. now we have FFW five, five backpacks. Oh, wow. Five. Yeah. I can't see anything. Do it. Right? So, okay, we you start here. Yeah. Okay. Peter Batschik. Yeah. Peter. Uh, Marco Santos. Uh, Daniel Nikolov. And Marta Marczak. Marta Marczak, yeah. And then James Shields. Congrats. <laughs> okay. And then we have one person getting Ooh. a bag with Slovenian goodies from oh. Agile Drop. Are we giving hints from next year or? No. That is Salim Kwasi Sada. Ah. Uh -huh. You want no, to drop the no, name I know of the city for next to year, this. or what are you doing? <laughs> so, finally, one-year pro subscription to the Back Beaver Cloud Backups. Okay. One winner. The final winner is Alexandru Drago. Congrats! So, thank well, that's you. actually interesting. We have to. We have to before we go to the where we are going. Maybe next year. Yeah. Um, so, how many? Like, we normally talk about the countries, and we love Eurovision. We were mm -hmm. always talking about that. How can we make this into Eurovision that you all are here with your flags? Because most Let's attendees see. this year yeah. are coming from Germany. Congrats. I think it was almost 200 people coming from Germany. So is that where next year is going to be? That could be. But then we have number two, United States. Ah, congrats. Thank you for coming all the way. And then seeing you there in the back, some of you from United Kingdom. So, and we All can right. just certainly tell you that this is not normally the results in the Eurovision Song Contest. So one of these countries <laughs> is the answer to where we see you next year. One of these countries, because we see you next year in, in. Pittsburgh, <laughs> of course. <laughs> In the U.S. So, uh, call for speakers. Ooh, do speakers you hear it? Do you feel it? <laughs> the call for speakers is already open. And application for volunteers for a speaker review committee are open. So, if you'd like to be involved in figuring out who's speaking in Pittsburgh, now is the time to be involved. But we are joking all the time about the next event, and we're making these jokes. So, okay, so... Really, like, what about the next European event? Okay. That he At least the one that we know of. One that we know of. Because there's always happening a lot of events in Europe. There's one that we didn't know that much that we can actually announce. It's going to be Drupal, Drupal Developer Days. Developer Days. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> in Vienna in the summer. Yep. So we have here the Austrian community. I know that you're all here. Thank you for taking this on, organizing one of the great events that we have here in Europe every year. Yeah, so meet there in hopefully July. They are still booking the dates as we speak. So it's going to be in the summer. It's going to be a lot of fun. So all right, but maybe, <laughs> OK, we might now, now joked enough, uh, do you think? Do you? So re <laughs> is it really about Republican Europe now? Yeah, and you said that guy knows where it's going to be. Who knows? Do you know? No, I only know a little about... I, so, I, this guy here knows. Yes. Um, so, this is Kretek. You all got to know him in the beginning. And uh, he's drinking beer uh, from Prague. And we are having a new mascot. And don't say anything if you know, if you give this hint of something. So please take a seat because Kretek wants to have a word. So I'm, I'm obviously speaking for Kretek because he can't say so much himself. So dear mascot, you are going to be going at least to Vienna. That we know. Yeah. All and the there's, camps, of there's gonna maybe gonna go to Pittsburgh even. <laughs> that would I, be interesting. Like it was a challenge to take this person here with us, but that's a little we bit bigger. We can take it as a comfort animal though. Okay. On but the airplane. 
Should we maybe it's check? Nice. So if you think about alcoholic beverages, which we had here because Kretek was drinking that, maybe we should hint off, like, what, what do you think that this would like Drink, drinking? Is it yeah. also beer? Because if it was beer, then it would be Germany, right? No. So what are we going to give this one? Yeah, what do you think? Yeah, it must be wine. Ah. Okay, okay. Still, like... <laughs> So is it going to be in Hungary then, like, I know there's a famous Hungarian, no? Yeah, 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 yeah. Anyway, let's see the video for next year and then you will know. Yeah. <laughs> You know, Betty, in the opening ceremony, we, we joked that we only know a little about where the event is going to be. Mm, we actually told Nobody you. Nobody got it. Nobody. <laughs> we had to. We already <laughs> said it in the opening ceremony. Yes. So We had here, uh, we had bringing the mascot that we don't have a name for yet, but a uh, representative from uh, Lille in the convention center that's going to be greeting us. She is here. So she was the one who actually brought this in here, you know, so you could have seen yeah. <laughs> But we can, we can never pull off any event. And, and again, here to the local uh, Drupal organizers from here, thank you so much for everything, because we cannot do this with the help of the Drupal community in the country that we are going to. Yep. So the Drupal Friends team has, of course, like known this for a while, and hey. I think they're taking over. So. It's See you again. again. <laughs> Take it away. What? <laughs> Me again? Yeah. Hey. Uh, I've been knowing this for a while, so I'm finally, finally I can say, yeah, it's going to be in France. Yay. But, you know, we have a long-standing history of love between France and Drupal. Do you know, first of all, can I hear the Frenchies, please? Please, make. Yeah, 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 because, sorry Germans, but there's a lot of us too, so. 
Um, so do you remember when was the last DrupalCon in France? Does anyone know? Yeah, you're good. Well, did you know that the website is still up? Oh. <laughs> I bet you didn't. Um, I don't know if you know this guy, the maître de cérémonie, Dries. Pretty amazing looking. But I'm sorry to break it to you, but the conference is sold out. So. But as a Frenchie, I was very interested to find this practical section about uh, food. Because I don't know if you're aware, but French people actually descend from hobbits. We're always worried about second breakfast. Uh, but then that's not the only event that happened in France, obviously. We also had Drupal Dev Days in 2015. I think some of you went there. And yeah. Um, in 2017, someone asked, what's your favorite piece of conference swag? And well, Theodore said, hands down, the Drupal spoon. And you know, in April this year, Webchick asked the same question to Twitter, and Twitter answered again. The French swag is the best swag. I'm sorry. It has to do about food, so you know, it's always useful. So what about next time then? <laughs> you will have to come to see. Uh, speaking about food, uh, Lille is not only beautiful and rich in history and beautiful monuments, they also have amazing food, like the Welsh, the Tarte Maroual, mussels, sugar pie, and my favorite, of course, uh, waffles. You don't know these ones, I, I swear to you, these are amazing. So enough with the food. And this is the French board. Um, we will be working with Quoni and the Drupal Association to ensure that you have the best experience possible when you come to France, and we just can't wait to see you there. So, yeah, please a warm, warm, warm round of applause for our new mascot and the organizing team that will make it happen next year. Thank you. Okay. All right. So oh. that was it for our closing session or wrap-up ceremony. Let's see each other tonight at Trivia and tomorrow on the Contribution Day. We will be there. We already did the first selfie with the mascot. So if you want to do a selfie, yeah, then that's the time. Uh, thank you, everyone, for coming. And we really hope that you will have fun tonight and tomorrow in the Contribution Day. See you next year. Yeah. Thank you.